This is how Maurit says that everybody's dancing nowadays. <laughs> At the airport, sun is shining. Going from Milan to Paris. My favorite fashion week, actually. In the meantime, got my travel bag. And I quickly wanted to show you guys what I have in my travel bag. Are you ready? The case where I put my camera in. Then I've got a little toilet bag over here of Louis Vuitton. And I've got with me my skin food. Elizabeth Arden 8 hour cream. A Maison Margiela perfume that I haven't used yet. A lip pencil which is the Laura Mercier. It's called Naked. That's it. Sunglasses case. Gum. Earplugs. Okay, very randomly. A orange. This orange has traveled with me from Amsterdam to Milan and now from Milan to Paris. Elements, so also these medjool dates. These are my favorite. Socks, phone, earplugs, tea, my detox tea. Don't know if it works, but I want to believe it. A beanie, and these are medicines. And there's this girl for a fashion show. She takes these Polaroids and then she gives them to me, which is so cute. And that's everything, except for my beanie. Ta da! Morning! We're in Paris and today is Dior Day. I'm actually going to be taking over the Dior Insta stories today, so I don't know if I'm able to vlog a lot. And there's a hairdresser from Dior that's going to do my hair. And I'm wearing this really cool Parisian like look. It's from the latest Dior collection. It's so cool and it's so me and it's so Paris. Just for your understanding, it's Tuesday today. My team is also flying in today from Amsterdam. And then we're also going to go to dinner tonight with them. The start of Paris Fashion Week. I'm excited. We checked in at the Plaza Atene, which is our home away from home, as you guys know. And this time we don't have a terrace, but we have a beautiful view from our balcony when you step outside. Good. Welcome to Paris, guys. Another Paris Fashion Week. Let's do this. I want to thank Franco here for doing my hair. Yeah, it really fits the Parisian look. <laughs> Thank you so much, Franco. It's really nice. You're welcome. Thank you. Hi, guys. So today I'm taking over Negan's vlog. And um, it's snowing. Here, look at this. It's actually snowing. So we are all super excited because um, Negan is taking over and I think maybe your Instagram stories no. yeah, for the show today. Absolutely. And uh, because she's so busy, I have to take over. Right? Oh, wherever. You sure? Put it here. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. 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 Uh, oh, we forgot. We're still a little bit in a hurry, so uh, Negan. <laughs> Get rid I'm taking over. This means we're getting in my schedule. What uh, what did the people say? This one. By how many percent? Sixty-one. Wednesday today and it's a day of three fittings. We're now Bama and I'm gonna try some really cool options. This is what I'm wearing right now. This is a vintage jacket. These jeans, I've been wearing these jeans for like three years 
and it's not branded so that sucks but these boots are from Iro Paris and this hat is from ASOS let me quickly show you the options this one like or love a lot but then I'm like can I pull this off during the day because it's a day show mm, I really 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 love this overall how cool so sick and then this one is really cool with these pants oh and let's not forget about this it's really cool as well options options I'll keep you posted I'll show you the looks oh my god I already love this look how beautiful it is it's so cool hi Estelle thank you <laughs> this is Estelle she's helping me out today and this is a backpack that you can just wear like this oh I love it but I also love the first one I don't know trying to see if this one closes no well, at least it gives me a waist <laughs> oh not so comfortable but <laughs> did the job I have a waist though <laughs> like this <laughs> what do you think we stopped by the Eiffel Tower and we filmed another one of our videos where Maudis and I dance it's so funny it was so cold it was freezing minus five I think good morning it is today Thursday and my team is now on its way because today we're gonna shoot some really cool content for the zoo and oh yeah last night my battery died we had to go to an event and we that's what i was sort of trying to say and then we passed by the eiffel tower <laughs> and it was freezing but maurice and i started dancing there it's really crazy but it was a lot of fun it was so so cold but so fun but that sequin dress that i was wearing it just you know how sometimes if they're not properly made they can hurt your body well they did mine was from asos it was really like super inexpensive that was nice but then it just hurts my body now all over i have those scratches you know from the sequence so that's everything's painful anyway we're gonna shoot for gizu i'm not saying this because i want you to follow gizu which i obviously want on instagram but i'm not joking when i'm saying this coming half year i'm like bursting from really good ideas for gizu where you guys will be really involved like on a different level it's gonna be so cool so do follow Gizu guys because I don't think you're gonna regret it. It's gonna be like really cool. I just honestly can't wait to start doing it. But we have to like prep some things for it obviously. That's what I wanted to say. Follow along. So we're gonna shoot now and then at night I have a dinner on another note. Do you remember that last week I was talking about like my dad and his situation. Like I was really nervous for this week because we we're, were gonna get the results of his scans and everything. Well we got them yesterday and it's good news and I honestly when my sister told me I'm so happy because they were really good but like I'm still so afraid that I don't want to be too happy but the results are really good so I'm just so so happy and I cannot believe it. But yeah that's something I wanted you to know. Ma, you want to say good morning to everybody? Morning. Makasaibo. Oh, I thought you were having a Heineken in your hand, but it's a no, green juice. <laughs> it's a green juice. <laughs> I wish, I wish. Quickly wanted to show you the end result. I did a natural makeup. I've been trying out these new mascaras that I really love from Kiko. These three, and I like them a lot. Always using waterproof mascara, of course. Then this eye pencil from Benefit. Number five. It's a little dark, so I'm like really careful with it. I want to see how number four is, but I like it. I used to use like really like taupey kind of colors, but now I do it a little bit darker. Then two liquid highlighters that I love. Charlotte Tilbury. Easy highlighter. And the Naked Skin Highlighting Fluid. What else did I use? I used this palette a little bit for my face. This is the, the Manetizer Sisters from The Balm. And I want to open it and show you the colors that are inside. So basically it's like a shimmering bronzer, 
shimmering blush and the highlighter and i use this a lot or actually i don't use this a lot i want to use this a lot more oh my foundation of course first i use a little bit of this paula's choice because it's light and i do like a little bit of my um dark spots with that and then of course the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation number 6.5 And that is the look This is the hair I actually used my hair mask last night when I went to the shower And then I put in like a little bit of a curl and then I went to bed And then this is how it looks now It's really shiny and everything I like it It's time to open up the breakfast drawer <laughs> so this is where we keep everything here i'm going to be needing my oatmeal my peanut butter this is maritz's this is mine then my protein powder then my chia seeds and that's it for now oh and the tea <laughs> team is here i'm gonna talk through the day while i'm having my breakfast thanks for my next scene, I have to eat chips. I don't mind. By the way, you guys know that there are these mukbangs on the internet now. Where people eat, I guess, like food. I don't know if it's always bad food or not. And then they talk about subjects. So Romy and I <laughs> were joking once that we should eat like, like veggies while we do a mukbang. You know, just like broccoli, carrots, quinoa. Oatmeal. Mm. So we're filming now for the baby. Oh, it smells so good. And it's actually really quite late. It's five past five and then we have to hurry up because I have a dinner planned for tonight. And so we're um, a little bit behind schedule. But it's all good. I'm also wearing, look how cute this is matching, like the leopard and then the packaging of the mask. And this is like a Victoria's Secret bedrobe and it's really cute. So we still have some things to do and I will see you later. Okay, so good morning. It is 11.20 March 2nd. On our way to the Beaumont show. It's raining outside. On our way, so I'll see you later. This is the venue of the Beaumont show. Oh my god, guys, look at what we're all wearing. Look how cute. Show me your look. Oh my god. Change of clothes and we're having lunch. This is my lunch. This is avocado, beetroot, tomato, and then this bread is so good. Okay, so what we're gonna do, my team is gonna come right now. And then we're gonna work for like a couple of hours. Then they're gonna leave, they're gonna go home. And then we have a fitting with Louis Vuitton. So yeah, we're gonna work, then I'm going to fitting Louis Vuitton, then I have a dinner, I don't know where we're gonna go. And then I have a birthday. I feel like fashion week is almost over. A couple of days left. I have to say that I've been enjoying fashion week a bit more. Because, okay, let me tell you a little something. There was this girl, a, um, I think she's a German blogger. But she came up to me at the Versace show. And she said to me, you know what, thing? you always look so relaxed and calm. Like you got everything together and that um, I know exactly what to do and everything. And I told her not only to make her feel good, but also to tell her the truth in that I guess when you're from the outside, sometimes when you're like inside this fashion world, there's like a kind of pressure that we girls put on ourselves basically, because we're all like so ambitious, we put a lot of pressure on ourselves. We do projects, we do collaborations and we're going to shows and events. And that's why we're really sort of trying to, I guess, get the most out of ourselves but also that can be like really hard from time to time especially when you sort of forget about the real world outside and you're sort of like in this bubble for a little bit um, which is usually the case during fashion week so i told her i'm like 
I might look that way, but I'm stressed out as well. And she in a way was really relieved that she wasn't the only one. So I felt like it's a good thing to say to all of you guys as well. Is that even though sometimes it looks like we got things all figured out and we know exactly what to do. Everybody gets stressed during fashion week period. I often have a lot of times where I just don't feel really good about myself I guess. Um, but this season has been a little bit different because I guess that what happened with my dad I started putting things more in perspective and so I started to enjoy this like world a bit more and not worrying about like oh does a person like me or not or I've never been that girl anyway like I've never been the one who goes up to people and is like Oh, you know what? You're important. I want to take a picture with you. Like I've never cared about those stuff, but I also don't worry anymore. So it's been it's been a really that way like a chill fashion week. I just do my thing. Uh, of course, still we get stressed because we're late or whatever. But I guess my message to all of the girls also is just to, like do things as the way you think is best, and then don't worry about all the other stuff. In the end also when you're like figured out like your own path i guess nobody can stand in your way and um you've got it all figured out so i guess that's it i guess that's all i want to say i don't know if it makes any sense and it's just gonna be you and i the team is leaving us yeah. oh yeah <laughs> Maris is always fascinated how long i can look at myself no joke. Yeah. <laughs> a couple of hours later Maurits took a nap so now he's taking a shower and I'm touching up my makeup because we're going to dinner and then we're going to Camilla's birthday party so yeah it's the weekend in Paris wish and then wish Maurits do me what you said to me younger dancer this is how Maurits says that everybody's dancing nowadays do it <laughs> Bonjour mon ami It's Saturday so we decided to go to a terrace and um, drink a coffee and um, the weather is super nice so um, it's a perfect Saturday Tomorrow yeah. will be raining so we have to enjoy it Yeah, look No time for romance By the way this is soy milk For those who are wondering This top I think is from ASOS or Urban Outfitters and this beret as well these rings are new this one and this one they're from Dior and actually this one as well <laughs> all my new rings are from Dior going to a meeting on a Saturday I just felt like still wearing a little bit something casual but then with this with these pants and then these shoes and I'm wearing on my lips the Kylie Velvet Liquid Lipstick in a color mood. First of all, Alexander Wang. This bag is from Valentino. Then this turtleneck is Urban Outfitters. And these pants are... Mao, can you see from what this broek is? Topshop. Topshop? So Topshop. It's really cool. like it a lot. So that's my quick outfit change. Meeting is a wrap. And now we want to go to La Dure and buy Camilla. It was her birthday yesterday. Now we want to buy her some macarons. Thank you. What a gentleman. Gentle. Hi. Ah, I'm so happy. Thank you. Look, these all are all sweets. the cakes. Oh my god. I have a million birthday cakes. This one. Mm. Oh, so good. <laughs> the entire yeah, room is full. <laughs> Did I already mention that this is the point of Fashion Week month? Or for me, in my case, Milan Fashion Week and Paris Fashion Week. This is the point where 
I'm getting a little bit tired because as you guys know it's a lot of running around from one meeting to another shows fittings everything and it's super fun super exciting and i love it a lot but i'm starting to get tired so what is the best thing to do when you're tired do a workout and that's why i got my workout clothes on oh and did i mention that it is a saturday night and while everybody is gonna go to fun parties and everything we're going for a workout and Chill, work out in France tonight at work. Friends? Watching Friends? Oh, watching Friends. Uh, where do you get this new shirt from? I got it online. It's nice. I know. Good morning. It's Sunday from Paris. I did my hair like this. What do you guys think? I love it. This is what I did when I was younger as well. If you're from the 90s or like I think 25 years or up you know this hairdo uh, when I was doing it this morning Maris was like no what are you doing with your hair and I was like oh I love it by the way I'm wearing Maris's shirt I received a gift from Dior this is my very cute walk-in closet here at the plaza how nice and then I just opened these new kitten heels from Dior and I love them so much. They're so, so cute. But thank you so much Dior, I love them. Today we're going to the Valentino show. I'm going to get dressed in a sec. What else is new? What else is new with you guys? My hair is new. So, I'll see you in a bit. Yes! This is my look to the Valentino show. Really obsessed with these boots and with this bag. It has a little heart. And then this is the hair and the outfit and the gloves because I'm compensating for my legs. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go. <laughs> to go but I changed into this awesome bomba look that I also wore at the fitting and I'm gonna take a photo with it because I usually don't do that when I don't have a reason to go anywhere but this is just such a cool look that I kind of have to such a good dress it's stunning I'm ready to take off my makeup and call it a day. Starting our Monday like this. Cheers. This is the breakfast room at the Plaza Atheny and it's so magical. It's really cool. And then they set up all of these amazing goods. And they sure know how to treat you like a princess. Cheers. We're at the Saint Laurent store and I was in doubt between the black boots or the brown ones and I got them both because I'm gonna wear this one to Coachella I think Okay, so again my look, this is from ASOS, I think this is Urban Outfitters, this jacket is Tourette's, Chloe These pants are as Tourette's as well, but look, I just spilled with lunch And then my Prada boots that I have to close still um, and then my Valentino bag as well I really really love this look I want to wear this more often this is so me I was just getting ready and um, I was wearing this lip color and I quickly wanted to show you guys because I love this color and if you can still get it you should and this is not sponsored it's the Balmain L'Oreal color in the number Fever. It is like this orangey kind of color. It's really cool. And then I sort of mix it because this is too orange. But then I mix it like with any other like nude. Yeah, I just quickly wanted to mention that because I really love it. And I think it's like my new staple in my makeup collection. OMG, I can't believe that this is the last show of Paris Fashion Week of Fashion Month. Okay, this is my Louis Vuitton look. And 
loving my hair and then this is the lip color i was talking about i'm gonna say bye to everyone we're gonna pack our bags after i'm gonna go home i'm gonna spend like a nice week with my family before we're going to london for a project thank you so much for coming along p.s i'm thinking about doing like a daily vlog series again but this time when i just film it myself maybe when i go to la in three weeks or something i can do something daily i don't know thinking about it though let me know what you think love you so much thank you for following along and um thank you also for like commenting on my instagram photos and here on youtube i almost read every comment yeah thank you so much see you later